Manhattan police have suspended their all-out search for a pair of carjacking suspects in Sherburne. A sheltering place that impacted this town and Natick has also been lifted. Thanks for joining us here at Noontime. I'm Paula Evan. It was a frightening situation for many people in the area as dozens of officers moved in with weapons. As WBZ's Anna Myler tells us, the suspects were also reported to be armed. Police say two men crashed a stolen car right here on North Main Street and then attempted to take another car at gunpoint. They were unsuccessful and ran off, setting off an intense search in this quiet suburb. But I've never seen anything like this before. Neighbors were stunned to see officers with long guns and police dogs scouring yards in Sherbourne this morning, searching for two suspects believed to be armed. And when my wife came out the door to ask what was going on, they were just like, red alert, just go back inside, keep the door locked. Sherbourne police say just before 6 o'clock this morning, this white Alfa Romeo crashed into a telephone pole on North Main Street. Police say the vehicle was stolen in Sudbury earlier this week. After the crash, police say the men got out of the car and attempted to carjack a nearby vehicle at gunpoint. John DeSalvo's neighbor saw it happen. He said he saw two guys get out of the car and try and get in the car behind them. Sherborne police say the suspects were unsuccessful at stealing the car and ran off. The police told me they ran through my driveway and between my barn and my house. And uh, so I woke up and I was just like, look, look in my barn, check out my barn, like just want to make sure I'm safe. The tense situation prompted the Pine Hill Elementary School to cancel class for the day and students and staff at Natick High School were ordered to shelter in place. That shelter in place has been lifted and the active search has been called off, but the two suspects are still on the run. I'd love to know that they got caught. Police described the suspects as two black men about six feet tall, one wearing a camouflage top, the other wearing a red hooded sweatshirt. Anyone who sees them should call 911 immediately. Reporting in Sherborne, Anna Myler, WBZ News.